Good evening. This is Visual Radio Arts and Soundcheck live from the old fire station in Froome. I'm Patrick Moss, Magpie Patrick, and I'm here to present the Brackish, who are behind me. In a few moments, we'll hear their music. Uh, just to remind you, all of you who are watching, to share and like us on Facebook. You'll be able to see this stream live on our Facebook page or later edited on visualradioarts.co.uk. And we also now have, as you'll find on our Facebook page, if you like what you're listening to, we have a pay now function uh, just to let us give some contributions to the running costs. Um, but that's enough about Visual Radio Arts and enough talking from me immediately. Like I say, here we have the brackish. Take it away, guys.
That was uh, a new tune <laughs> called, what's it called? Firm But Fair. Firm but fair. <laughs> this next one is off the last album, it's called Liquid of Choice, which is the name of the album too. Thanks for listening, if anyone's listening. <laughs> All right. <laughs>
Cheers, Clark. Uh, what's next? Bango's Christmas.
<laughs> well, that was the brackish, the first set. Uh, that was a fantastic sound, guys. Oh, oh brilliant. Yeah. Um, got to ask two questions, really. Uh, we've got a few minutes to talk to you now while you take a breather. Uh, it looks fairly energetic playing that. Yeah. Particularly on the drums, I've got to say. <laughs> yeah, maybe don't talk to me for a couple of minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Need to keep fit. <laughs> yeah. Um, what are your influences? Uh, well... God, they're, they're very broad. What yeah. generally, or with this, with this sort of band, or with this particular with this band? band. Well, I mean, what what did you listen to that leads you to this point? Whether well, it could be in the dim and distant past when you were using your parents' yeah. record player or whatever. It's, uh, um, well, definitely stuff for me like the the Magic Band, the Captain yeah. Beefheart's Magic Band, yeah. and and the later stuff as well, and um, some uh, early Zappa stuff. Um, yeah, the, the okay. Zappa. I could I could feel Zappa coming yeah. through in some yeah. of that. Yeah. Um, but then also. Yeah, I mean, yeah, even like sort of funk stuff as well. Yeah. You know, oh, it's definitely like a blend, a definite fusion yeah. in there. Yeah. yeah and well, and you can see quite well, strong, yeah. 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 Actually, jazz was one of the things that reminded me of. My misspent studenthood in right. the Four Bars Inn in Cardiff was, right. uh, there were echoes of that coming through. Wrong yeah. instruments, but very yeah, much yeah. the very Just much louder, the sound. just with pedals. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, but yeah, and also, I guess... And lots of rock stuff, things like Sabbath yeah. and, you know, yeah. Hendrix and, mm. yeah, got... Yeah. yeah, and I don't know. I'm trying to think of some <laughs> modern things. There's quite a lot of my old vinyl collection coming. Yeah, 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 yeah. For me, it's definitely a lot of old, old stuff, really. Yeah. Okay. Um, so, how do you write it? I assume you do write it. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. We definitely do. We either usually have a couple of ideas and we'll, we'll jam it in in the room. Yeah. And write a tune like that, and then just keep tweaking the arrangement over the subsequent rehearsals. Or Neil will have a whole tune pretty much ready to go, or I will have a whole tune ready to go. But I'd say that was probably like 50% of it, and the other 50% is us kind of just trying out ideas and um, doing a lot of jamming and then recording it and seeing what works and utilising that and, you know, with fresh ears, kind of getting rid of the stuff that's rubbish and okay. keeping the stuff that's good. <laughs> okay. Do you improvise during the gigs? Yeah. 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 Not loads, but... It's and maybe like sort of 30% of it. There's sections that are improvised. So. Yeah. And they're based on, they're all done on like nods or little cues or something. Okay. Like a no, little motif that might bring back in the arrangement or something. Right. So who is it that actually writes it? Is it? Uh, well, we all do if we're doing it, you yeah. know, like in a room. But um, sometimes I'll have whole tunes ready to go and Neil will as well. Right. Okay. Yeah. Um, so it kind of works around usually m me and Neil's I initial ideas. Right. Okay. Um, yeah. Neil over there on the guitar. Yeah. You're the other guitarist. Yeah. This is Lord Luke, for those who didn't see the... <laughs> <laughs> didn't see the <laughs> <laughs> Lord Luke of Brackish. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Um, <laughs> and on the drums, uh, you've got a fairly energetic co job keeping going with this. Yeah. Yeah. yeah <laughs> is that your job. normal style? I mean, do you... It depends on the music. Like yeah. I, do, I do like a bit of a rock out, but I'm quite happy to do uh, more delicate things as well. Right, OK. Quiet. But you don't often get called on to do that with... Yeah, uh, not with this band, no. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> do you have the old tender moment? Yeah, we do. We? Yeah, there's a brush, a brush makes an appearance on <laughs> one, one or two tunes, but not right. today. Yeah, OK. And on bass, mm -hmm. um, are you keeping up with the energy of the rest of them? Yeah, Jay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's simply... It's, um, oh, sorry. It's definitely a workout. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. No, it's a really good, powerful sound. There's a difference between a powerful sound and being noisy. Mm. And you're very yeah. definitely into the powerful sound category. Yeah, uh, well, the dynamics mean that, I guess, if you're dynamic, then you've got some sort of context with the loud stuff. Yeah, uh, I mean, Otherwise that's, that's it's it. It's quite it's nuanced loud, it? listening to it. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, you, you, have, yeah. you have rhythm and flow in there. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and the, the music changes yeah. those patterns as you go through. It's yeah, I mean, some stuff we'll do will be quite gentle all the way through and some will be heavy all the way through. But a lot of this, that stuff, I guess, we've been doing now is quite, quite dynamic. Yeah. It just keeps it kind of interesting. Absolutely, it does. Um, but there's nothing wrong with it just being loud, but, you know, it's nice to... No, it, have it done, no, that's a joy to listen to. Yeah, yeah, yeah that was. Yeah. Um, it's more fun for us to play like that. I'm sure. Yeah, um, you mentioned. Yeah, obviously, you're live here. Yeah. You have albums. This sort of stuff on albums. Yeah, 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 yeah. Although, I think all those tunes are new, aren't they? No, no. Actually, one of them, one of them's from the second album, Liquid right. of Choice, and the song was Liquid of Choice. The other two right. songs we did, the 
uh, not released yet, but it's all been recorded. Are they on? Are they on? It's going to be called yet to yes, be released. For, on yeah, I think it's going to be called Firm but Fair. Right. Okay. Yeah. Any dates when that's coming out? Not not yet. No. I mean, it'll be finished soon, and then we just got to find someone to release it. In. So we're okay. About that right. Okay. Yeah. We wanted to get it on vinyl this one because uh, yeah. the others yeah. have only been CDs. Right. Okay. So you need to find vinyl pressing company, etc. Yeah. Hopefully, some <coughs> if a label will pay for it. Yeah. Be ideal. Yeah. Bit of yeah. Money up front that we'll yeah. you know pay back later. Be good. Please. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Wow, okay, I I that's stuff. great stuff. And we mentioned you've got gigs coming up. Yes. Because this is a quick yeah. chance to promote those. Yeah. Um, dates. Yeah. Dates. Oh, gigs. no, not again. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> First of September, you're at the Beaufort. Yeah, Beaufort. Oh, yeah. Beaufort Arms in, in Clifton and Bristol. Yeah. yeah, amazing pub. Yeah, brilliant and pub. then after that, you're on a mini tour sometime late September. Yeah. Are these, I mean, never mind giving them out now, are these all on your Facebook page? Or will they? Yeah. Or yeah. They will be, yeah. yeah. Do you have a website, or is it just a Facebook just page? Just the band camp in the Facebook. Right, okay. So yeah. if we go searching for the brackish on Bandcamp, we'll find you. Yeah, yeah, on the Facebook page. Yeah, yeah. Okay, that's great. That's. I mean, really enjoyed listening to that. Um, for everybody uh, out there on the ether, uh, you are listening. I'm Patrick Moss. This is Visual Radio Arts and Sound Check, and. You've got a few more for us, I think. Yes. Uh, I hesitate to call them tunes when they're, they're almost epics, aren't they? It's yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah. It's only going to get worse. <laughs> yeah, we've got, got a couple of concertos. Well, I, <laughs> I'm reminded of those vinyls I used to have where, you know, you like got either one track or two tracks on each side. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, no, yeah. Our that's vinyls are going to be that big. That's how we're going to You're going to go to the 16-inch vinyl, aren't yeah, you? Yeah, yeah, we're going to maybe 48. Yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> OK, um, this is The Brackish. Um, just quickly tuning up again. Two guitars. You've, obviously, it works because I've been listening to it. And it yeah. Works. Yeah. But it's not the most common of combinations, is it? No, but uh, well, it is, isn't it? In rock music, but yeah. But me maybe not so much in indie kind of bands, I guess. Yeah. Maybe, but, yeah. 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 So it, it's. Uh, but you know, you know, Sonic Youth, don't you? That band, Sonic Youth. Oh yes. And yeah. television, you know, yeah. people yeah. like that do it. So well, and King Crimson as well. So. Yeah. Oh yeah, I mean, these the, are good influences I couldn't think of a minute ago. Right. Okay. <laughs> yeah. 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 Okay. That's uh, great. Lizzie. <laughs> yeah, because I think you mentioned as we were having yeah, our pre-chat that you wanted a chance to play in, <laughs> in a band with two guitars. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So it's it's great to you know to work. We, it's really easy actually. The way we work together is just works that easy to be honest with you. Right. So yeah. It's great. It's great yeah. yeah. <clears throat> okay. Are we done? Getting We're getting there, there yeah. with the tuning up, aren't yeah. we? Yeah. Yeah. Although these guys start this one, so. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so yeah, it's all right. I'm just mindful of that, you know, the odd joke about, you know, what a splendid piece of music that was. <laughs> <laughs> Three and a half minutes of tuning up. Yeah. Uh, this one's in G major. <laughs> Okay. Sure. okay. Are we ready to roll? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that's great. Uh, everybody out there on the ether, this is Soundcheck with Visual Radio Arts, um, and this is The Brackish.
Uh, all right, that was BM off, and this is Birdman. <laughs>
Well, again, what a sound. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, guys. Uh, this is Soundcheck on Visual Radio Arts. You have been listening to Brackish. Uh, the Brackish, I think, to be precise, yeah. isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Right. Luke, Lord Luke, <laughs> <laughs> Neil... <laughs> Matthew. Prince, Prince Matthew. Matthew. Prince, Prince, Prince Matthew. Matthew. Thank you. Yeah, that's been absolutely splendid. We've loved it. Thanks um, a lot. It was us asking for more. <laughs> so, um, quickly to just say, you can find their music on the Brackish Bandcamp. If you, we've just tried it. If you search the Brackish, it's it pretty, comes up. Pretty good, it comes it? Yeah. up. Yeah. Yeah. Um, <laughs> you can also find this gig if you've been watching it. Um, you can find it later once we've edited it and uploaded it. Uh, on the Visual Radio Arts website, visualradioarts.co.uk, I think. Uh, but if you, again, if you Google Visual Radio Arts, you'll find us. Uh, if you've enjoyed this, if you've been in a bar, you'd have been buying a coffee. If you feel like putting that sort of cost towards our costs, there's a Shop Now button on the Visual Radio Arts Facebook page just to help us towards the running costs of doing these shows because we know you all love them. We know from the number of hits that we get that you love them. So but for tonight... Um, thanks, guys. Um, fantastic. I'm going to be searching out your albums, I think, after that. Yeah. And the next one's on vinyl. Yeah. 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 So that's, uh, that's a definite. Yeah. Well, so, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, when it comes out, yeah. it'll be a definite. Yeah. I'll be looking for it. Um, yeah, I don't think there's much else to say. Thank you. Thank you. Um, search them out on Facebook. Search them out on Bandcamp. Search out their gigs. The next one of which is the 1st of September at the Beaufort. So, great pub. Yeah, great pub, great band. So, thanks a lot and good night, everybody. We hope you've enjoyed it. <laughs>